370 uh, incident. I will be distributing a, a written uh, press release on this, but I can confirm that I've been in on the line and we've been speaking with GACC in Australia um, and with Angus Houston. Um, and operations are, like as we all know, the Bluefin 21 AUBs have been uh, deployed and uh, 16 hours um, have been uh, done to search and photograph the seabed and photographs uh, are being analyzed at the moment. The same applies for, to the oil slick found and collected yesterday 5.5 kilometers away from the site. Um, this has also been collected and uh, being tested. So as you know, um, the operations with the JACC and our um, link up with, or my personal link up with uh, Angus Houston has been ongoing notwithstanding um, DSA here in PWTC. On Malaysia's part, um, I, will, I can confirm that the international investigation team uh, is being set up. Uh, we will probably be able to table uh, the memorandum of, uh, to the cabinet um, the next time the cabinet meets, probably next week. Um, the three ministerial committees have been meeting, uh, led by the three deputy uh, ministers, Hamza Zainuddin, the deputy foreign minister, who has been uh, tasked to look at the uh, various issues relating to the next of kin, as is Kaprawi, the deputy transport minister, who has been tasked to look at the terms of reference of the international investigation team, which will be made known to the public in due course, and also technical aspects of our SAR. And the third ministerial committee, led by uh, Dr. Abdul Rahim Bakri, who is the deputy defense minister, who is uh, monitoring the deployment of assets um, in the search area, which has now been narrowed and has now moved into uh, um, un uh, underwater uh, search uh, as announced by GACC um, a couple of days ago.